Well, welcome good people of TFA. Uh, just a short video, uh, building a new campaign and I had a little issue, or big issue, with uh, trying to make a mob look like a mob. Now we're all used to uh, AI going around in formation and following each other, but I didn't want that, so we have a little situation without giving away too much. We've got a, a bunch of cartel uh, on a beach some drugs there some other goodies I'm not going to mention and just a random civilian so I can uh, play the scenario now what will normally happen in this case if you look at the uh, from the map view you've got a, a unit all linked and they'll follow this guy so if you try to put in like patrols or various other actions they'll all mill around and effectively follow this guy which is not what I wanted so if you go in and we've got this set up and the random civilian so we can uh, actually see what's going off and when I can click on him play as the character and just wait the obligatory time takes a bit longer because I'm running on my general partition not the gaming partition so uh, yeah a little bit slower bit more laggy but uh, not a problem for mission building and as soon as it comes in usually at this point now I uh, sod off and get a drink yeah oh there we are okay so let it build and we have a look around and you'll see initially people start to wander around and then eventually they'll just set up and stay still in various positions yep all fine and dandy for a military unit that's uh, prepared and is guarding an objective but no good for a cartel mob which I want so okay obviously that is not what we want so we go back to the editor while that comes out basically what I'm going to be making use of is a, a little used module within the um, system modules and if you look across here go to system and then look for CBA modules and the patrol module if you push that into the center of your area patrol double click on its attributes and here you can see you can set patrol radius waypoint count waypoint type, um, their behavior, uh, speed mode, usual stuff you would have like in a, a group formation. Well we've created the group but what we're going to do is we're going to delink them so 20 meter, 25 meter patrol radius I'm going to drop that down to 20 and this will occur within 20 meters of this module so if we quickly go back to the map um, we find the um, link we highlight the grouping links oh that's Nez messaging and we get rid of all of those because we don't want that Oop. and another and I think oh one more there we go super so now we've delinked the unit so what we're going to do now is now we've set up the um, parameters for the wandering patrol 20 meter radius four waypoint count that will count four waypoints for each of the individuals now I've delinked them and then when we resynchronize them they will randomly generate their own walking pattern so okay we'll take the closest and we'll right click connect sync to the module same with this guy connect sync to patrol this guy connect sync to patrol I think you know the uh, gist of this so I'll shut up now and I'll just complete them off quickly the other thing I've thought about this and I'm gonna have a practice with later I've got uh, some civilians and usually the only way I can get them to like scatter about and pretend to be civilians is using um, garrison but all garrison does is they tend to want as garrison does find the nearest building and sod off that's 
not what you want. If you want a, if you want a village of, of civvies or a group of civvies to be civvies, I think this is going to be the way to go. Okay, so I've done the connect to sync to. We've de deselected the group, made them all individuals, and we've synced them to the patrol module with a 20 meter radius from this point. So let's let's hope, keep fingers crossed. And um, we'll go to the civvy and we'll play as the character. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I'm going to have a serious practice because I like to see civilians be civilians in an area rather than just standing there. Um, you know what the chicken shits are like. Sometimes they'll uh, crouch down. They won't move. But uh, if you want to be coming through a town that's got a moving population I'm, I'm hoping this will be the way to do it uh, and I'm hoping that this information will be useful for other mission makers so now we wait for uh, everything to catch up all the scripting to load within my uh, slow partition uh, we've got one guy wandering there oh and there goes another the good thing is that there is a delay why all the scripts go through and everything sorts itself out but usually all this will have taken place before we get anywhere near the area yep, the usual armor AI this one's oh and there goes another yeah it does take a little while so um, I'm gonna pause the video for now and I'll come back in a few minutes once uh, it's all sorted itself out, so catch you shortly. Okay, good peoples, we are, we're back, giving it a few minutes, and uh, as you can see now, you, apart from dipshit going in the water, but he'll come back out. As you can see, people are just aimlessly, like, wandering around, you know, uh, don't have a care in the world perfectly just what I wanted really really nice yeah they'll just wander randomly they won't they don't stick together they go their individual paths because they're not linked now I did fool myself at first because I wondered why this guy and this guy weren't behaving well they actually were behaving I've actually got both of these on an animation which means they won't actually move they'll carry on what they're doing until they're attacked so this guy's in a, a relaxed animation basically doing sod all and this guy being a good duty bound boy is guarding those sacks of drugs so these two won't move until they're attacked but the others they'll just wander around like a mob sometimes go for a swim <laughs> sometimes not it completely random they sometimes end up in pairs but it's just absolutely perfect for it and I've got ideas to test this now with civilian populations so that civvies oh my god two of them going swimming who cares yeah so we can have nice civilian populations mincing about as a uh, if they are just civilians quite an easy way to do it no s nasty scripting to do and it does the job so I hope the, uh, some of you found that interesting if you want to have a go in a mission. It's a useful tool, this module, that um, I'll be looking to employ in the future. And uh, hopefully someone can try it out to use it to their advantage. Uh, just as a spoiler, this is a, a little bit from my, uh, the first mission of a, a new campaign coming up soon. Uh, you can see we've got a lot of cartel members some drugs and a whole load of shenanigans so uh, we'll catch you all later and see you boots on the ground bye for now